An influencer recently got seven months in prison for stealing 5,000 votes from Hillary Clinton by telling rubes that they could text in their ballots in a Facebook post. Okay, one, I absolutely love this story because it uses the phrase rubes, which I haven't seen since that one Simpsons episode where they like had a go at the carnies. Two, kind of hilarious that all the voter manipulation and fraudulent election stuff comes from the conservative side. Hmm, <laughs> it's a shocker. Calls coming from inside the house. But three, in his defense, seven months for a Facebook post? Seven months for stealing votes? He didn't like go around with a sack and pick them up. He made a meme Facebook post. That's mad. I have seen people get death threats on Facebook and nothing happened to them. Like, if, if people looked through our Modern Warfare 2 lobby, like, voice chats, we would all be in jail. This is madness. I mean, did the private prison system need some more, like, people in it? Are they running low on the money? Also, you really should be able to vote by text. Like, I'd argue forcing hard-working shift workers, especially, people to leave work to go vote in person is more voter-manipulating than this.